Hi guys, uh, today we make another video about Umit SE and today actually about modification. Uh, so far I got that unit for a couple months. First modification I'd like to show you uh, that power supply has a weird adapter. Well, right now it has a US connector uh, lead. When I bought it has a European style for 220 and I did stop by a store like a Radio Shack and some few other ones try to find it a similar adapter a similar I mean uh, end but with US uh, lead like you see just right now and no one have basically what I did I cut it original one right here use it a US adapter cut it right in a half uh, put it together I mean I, I work around a little bit and make a really nice short style adapter which right now it's almost uh, two inches shorter than what, what I used before original adapter with with uh, US adapter from uh, US to European style anyway that's the first modification now it's like I said it's more portable uh, much less uh, uh, adapters I have to carry it with me and work work like uh, like it should be uh, unit like I said I own it all uh, used it almost for a couple months to be honest, it's really nice quality and I'm really surprised actually, zero scratches uh, that uh, coating where they apply it, it's really uh, nice and hard, uh, no scratches, nothing. Uh, actually, last time I, uh, when I make a video I tell you the unit didn't come with a uh, stylus, it does come with stylus. Well, it's a cheap piece of crap stylus, you can imagine it. I mean, it's a horrible. They should have included a toothpick and will be much usable than that stylus. I mean, you have to attach it. I know mean, it's made for attach it from side. And let me show you why I think it's bad. I mean, first of all, it's not comfortable. Second of all, it's attach it. I mean, if you attach it to a uh, uh, house, anytime when when you working, I mean, uh, with stylus, it's horrible. Plus, sometimes you can go. I mean, for example, if, if I'm using like that, and then then I drop it my hand, then I drop it my my hand down it's always catch a corner which I mean I, I don't like that for that uh, I did my own modification let me take that uh, crap stripes close it let me show you probably well I remove it uh, covers first of all I don't like it second of all it's always on the way when you when, when you plug it and uh, plus it's extra ventilation holes you know the unit works I mean really really I mean uh, uh, it doesn't have any issue with overheating or anything like some people saying. It's it's warm, but it's, it's, it's nothing extreme. Even if you use it and you charge it at the same time, it it, it doesn't get hot. Anyway, if you look at the system around, it looks almost as the same as before any modification. But right there, you spot it a little tiny. Look like a button. Let me show you it looks looks really really impressive to be honest really professionally done well actually it's uh, that modification I did it's my own design and it's really nice I mean it's too bad a camera probably is not gonna pick it up all details how, how how it looks really nice what's that it's a stylish basically with nail you pull it out let me show you and that's kind of stylish it's a collapsible stylish I make my own and I mean that end and I'll also make a, my own point it's made from RC antenna I did stop by at uh, Hobby Shack pick it up it's a nice collapsible stylus it's uh, probably like 12 centimeters long when with the full extent but one thing I like it first of all you don't have to attach it with any stripes or anything you go back and forth storage place it's really easy the unit, to be honest, doesn't have too much uh, storage. I mean, doesn't have, if you open it. I did open it uh, bottom part and screen to find it. What's the best place to locate it? Style, you know, where where should I put it? And to be honest, there is not much room anywhere, except only in that side. Yeah, that's why you see the stylish half stylish. It's the same length as as I, uh, as you can get here space maximum. But with, with uh, that kind of stylus, it's easy to work, work it, you know. You're not blocking the whole view of screen. And it's a nice, precise operation. Not like with original one, 
I mean, who designed that? It's 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 it, it's a complete joke. I know. I mean, few few others. Uh, young, I mean, uh, young PC come with similar uh, styles, you know, and that's pretty much useless. It's just really embarrassing. Even the system, to be honest, it's really nice design, really usable. I mean. To be, I mean, I, uh, I really like it, to be honest, I really like it. I bought that system, well, because some people ask me well, where you can get Umit SE, especially if you live in the United States. Uh, let me tell you, there's no uh, dealer or uh, reseller in the United States who sell uh, those units brand new with uh, full warranty. I bought mine from uh, South Korea, the company called uh, Export Prime. P-R-V-I-E and it's a $700 uh, cost uh, for the unit one year warranty and to be honest when I ordered mine a week later it did show up you know I was quite surprised because it I mean uh, uh, from South Korea to United States Alaska I was quite impressed anyway a uh, so second mod uh, well actually third mod like I tell you before, uh, the cameras on on those units. For, for example, I put it on my uh, on, on on the desk right now. The computer is pointed straight to me, like like I'm working right now. And if you look at camera, you actually see. I mean, my face. I mean, myself, right in the center of camera. All units when when they design a camera on the side like like that one or like uh, uh, Umit M1 or any other PC handheld, they always cameras pointed straight. That means you have to uh, just a second you have to uh, keep it unit on the side to make sure the camera pointed to you. Which to be honest, I mean in some cases it's really bad. I mean well actually that camera it was uh, not not so bad but still. I mean, it was, uh, I mean, uh, cutting uh, pretty bad. I tilted camera, and now when I hold it, my unit straight, I went right, right to the face to me. The camera shoots, it's a little bit in an angle, probably in a long distance. I'm talking about maybe 10, 10, 50 meters or whatever. Of course, it's gonna shoot it, I mean, way, way uh, to the left. But I mean, uh, when, when I'm gonna use something like that? When I'm typing, you know, I, I mean, I want to point it my camera towards me, not towards uh, uh, somebody else. You know. <laughs> anyway, pretty much uh, those uh, few few modifications, which which I, uh, I really, I mean, that unit doesn't have to be have those kind of modification. Well, with uh, with stylus, yeah, I mean, it's it's a useless, and you have to use it something else. Like I said, two speaks even work more more. Will be more usable than that uh, uh, style, which actually my style I like better. Well, I am always about modification, improving this, improving design, or something, something like that. And to be honest, I really, really proud how, how I did that. It looks, I mean, uh, some friend of mine who saw that unit with already modification. First of all, they thought it's a factory made. They thought it's a uh, Umit SE. Two or you meet this is some kind of upgrade for them. Which I mean, to be honest, it looks yeah, it looks nice and sleek. Looks like it's a factory made, but actually it's not. It's it, uh, it's my own. I hope uh, maybe you meet guys will, will saw that video and they're gonna update it. I mean, the model, which like I said, I mean, it's really nice and it's uh, I mean it's, it's 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 I like it to be honest. I hope you guys enjoy it my video. And thank you so much and bye-bye.